G'day everyone, Billy here. Well, Monday today, fellas, and Kayla, the beautiful rubbish dump girl, has just opened up the gate. So, I'm the first customer, fellas. So, anyway, hopefully, we're going to find some good stuff today, guys. I don't know what we'll find, but it's always stuff that I seem to find that I need. We'll have a quick look at these bins here, fellas. There'll be nothing in there. But usually, I'll find something good. See what goodies are sitting on top, fellas. Nothing I can see there. Nothing, fellas. It's all been stripped. Oh, here's a pot here. Aluminium pot. Oh, no, nothing special, but. There goes. No. No, it's just a Sometimes if it's not too low guys I'll jump in and if I see anything exciting. But no, that's it guys, just a strainer. All right, we'll go up to the scrap metal section and we'll go to the garden waste section. Hopefully we'll find something good, guys. It was a beautiful day yesterday. I came here Saturday, it was very, very quiet, fellas. Um, hardly anyone came in, but yesterday it was a beautiful day, so we might find something good, guys. Alright, so we'll get out. What's this, fellas? My old bikes. It's a nice old bikes, fellas. I'm probably 1970s era. See what we can find, guys. Small 10 speed bikes. Might probably take those wheels off my mate Bob for his metalwork sculptures. Okay, cheap guys. Oh, beautiful old wheelbarrow there. Something like this I'd pick up, guys, because of the beautiful old iron wheel. So I might grab that. Possibly that bird case too, fellas, in case I find injured birds, you know. Just a temporary home for them until they can be released or whatever. No, nothing really new in this section, fellas. But I come here at like 11 o'clock in the morning, I go, go and have some lunch, um, and come back about 2 o'clock. Nice motor here, fellas. Nice motor. It's a bucket I left here last time, I'll take that, I forgot it. So... So much money to be made, not just from scrapping fellas, but just by that washing machine motor. What I just found, you know, people, if you really wanted to, you could, obviously a lot of people make a lot of money from selling spare parts off washing machines and fridges like fan belts and electric motors. It's all worth money, guys, but you know, it's up to you fellas. You got motivation. You can make so much money just selling electrical goods and everything anyway there's a second customer for the day so we'll see what he's going to throw out fellas have another just a quick look so I scored the other day this is a birdcage stand here 
There's two of them. So I scored a beautiful one of these on Saturday, what someone threw out. I didn't want these two here. But yep, they're just for all those birdcage stands. Like this. I'm sure a lot of you fellas know what they are. Basically, if you've got a budgie or something like that, you just put the budgie outside in the sun and hang it up under one of these. Just like that. So, yeah, someone will pick those up probably. But anyway, guys, let's go and see what this guy's just throwing out. And we'll come back and pick up that wheelbarrow. I've got my angle grinder here today, so I might even just cut, or I'll probably take these nuts off and just pick up that beautiful old wheel. All right, guys, we'll leave this bucket in. I'll also get these bike tires, possibly, or the good bike tires from my mate Bob. All right, nothing special so far, fellas, except for that nice old wheel. So it's just luck of the draw, fellas. You know, sometimes you'll come out here and you'll find beautiful things, and other times you'll find hardly anything. But most of the time I do this. I do... Uh, usually go home and make a profit or at least pay for my petrol so I did a video on these cars the other day guys someone's been out here so hopefully someone might have seen my video and uh, came out here and removed those ties etc maybe hopefully if they did see my video they gave Kayla or her dad some money so a lot of people do come out to this rubbish shop guys and pick up stuff and they don't give Kayla or Dad anything. You know, they'll smuggle it out of the tip when they're not, not allowed to it. But it's pretty sad, you know, because Kayla only gets around 300 bucks a week just managing the, duck, the tip. But even beautiful chain, fellas, like this beautiful chain. It's all worth money, guys. That chain, beautiful rusty chain, believe it or not, you check on eBay gum tree research you know rusty iron chain and you'll come across heaps of beautiful old chain and people definitely buy it fellas they use for art and all that kind of stuff everything but, you know, nothing special here guys it's here unusual never seen a drum like that before looks like that's very unusual guys what's that a fuel can far out that is beautiful I've never seen a little tiny fuel can around one like that so I reckon I'll take that fellas we'll take that for sure that's an awesome find oh beautiful kitchen sink here guys On. Old lawnmower, shovel, I love finding these guys. Beautiful old shovels, so many beautiful shovels at home. Oh, look at this fellas. Look at this. What a struck it rich guys. Beautiful old, oh no it's only plastic but no. Oh, I thought I saw tools fellas. There are tools here, all rusty. Old bottle, not that old. No, someone's left a drum full of stuff out in the rain. It's all filled up with water. Could be an old axe head here or something. Money. 20 cents. Oh, more money. Amazing how much money I find out these tips, fellas. Bit of brass. Anyway, we'll come back. We'll come back and go through this, guys, but 
we'll put that this stuff in the back and then we'll head over to that domestic waste section over there in the garden section guys sorry for saying guys so much fellas I'm very aware of saying I know a lot of people don't say it but I've been saying guys ever since I was around 10 years 10 years old and I picked it up from watching TV shows like the Brady Bunch and and also reading comics like the Archie comics or the American comics but mate that's how I picked up saying guys I hate saying it fellas and I know I do say it heaps of times in my videos and I just don't even realize I'm saying it so I try and say fellas and when I do say fellas <laughs> I'm talking to women as well, girls. So, that's all I've got so far, fellas. A couple of nice little finds. So we'll chuck them in the back. So, I've also increased my broadband, or data use on my phone, guys, whereas before I only could use uh, 20 gig a month, but now I've increased it up to 90 gig a month. Happy with that, eh? So it only costs me an extra 10 bucks a month to get 90 gig a month. There's a couple of other things that I've hidden, fellas. Just a nice... What I'll pick up soon, later. Nothing special, but just a couple of things I need. So I just have a little this drum here, fellas. It could be a nice old... You know, come across these beautiful old drums that old but always keep an eye out fellas for the beautiful old fuel drums this is one litre if it was in gallons but it's in poor condition but some of them are worth many hundreds of dollars the old fuel drums anyway fellas we'll come back a bit of more aluminium here there could be some more obviously money in there we'll go come we'll go through money could be some tools an old exit or something Here, fellas. Oh, another shovel there, fellas, I reckon. Oh, no. But even that could be an old sign. See the corners? Could be a nice old sign, fellas. I doubt it. But... Big turn. Take a look. Nah. Nah. But, yep. Stainless steel. Stainless steel, fellas, not chimney. So we'll come back here later after I finish filming. Pick a bit of scrap metal for my phone, mate, Dale. So not too bad so far, fellas. A little bit of scrap. Find of the day so far is that little round fuel tin. Very unusual, never seen nothing like that before. Don't know if it's that old, guys, it's just got this sticker here. So it fits perfectly there in that triangle. So it might not be that old, but still, we'll take it home, give it a clean out, see if it's got any leaks, and maybe I could sell it one day. Alright, let's go up to the other sections. So there's another section around here too, fellas. So sometimes that's pretty good as well. I've actually got a few things hidden up there as well at the moment. Just a air conditioner. Sometimes if I'm feeling unmotivated, guys, I'll hide, hide stuff. Or if my truck's too full, I'll put stuff to one side in the bush. I've actually got quite a few things hidden around this dump at the moment. All the TV sections just over here, just in there. TVs and stereos. Sometimes come across some nice old stereos, ghetto blasters, etc. So I'm always looking for the old 1980s ghetto blasters and stuff like that. All worth money, guys.
take you for on after we do this one fellas we'll I'll take you to and quickly show you what I'm going to where they've bulldozed a heap of um, they've bulldozed oh, I can show you right now actually so just over here fellas is So I've got my trailer today guys, so I've just got to wait. hopefully my hand brakes on, it's not, but anyway. Um, so I hit right here fellas, is where they bulldozed another dump, see all the rubbish skipped off the surface, so one day we'll go for a walk through here and so we can find the relics, you know, and pots and pans and grass. Starting to blow, so we'll go for a walk over there, fellas. Where all that rubbish is, what I just showed you. The wind's just picked up, and that's all the farm chemical drums. Someone else has just turned up over there. And then, after right here, fellas, we'll go to the uh, garden waste section, see if we can find any nice tree logs my garden, pots and any free fruit, tomatoes, cucumbers, pumpkin. So I always seem to find stuff that I need guys when I come to these dumps. There could be some good stuff today fellas. Yep. Exactly what I need guys, exactly what I need. A new toilet. Look at that beautiful toilet. There's nothing wrong with that, fellas. Nothing wrong. That is a brand new toilet. That is brand new, fellas. And I'm not lying. I, don't, I need a new toilet. Pots. Look at this, fellas. Photos. I won't show you. It could be someone who doesn't want to be on the internet. A couple of photos in there guys, but I won't show you because it's privacy. But anyway, pots here. Oh, beautiful. This is for my mate Dale, the farmer. These They use these for sharpening uh, shearing, sheep shearing blades and so forth. I'll tell you what I do need guys, it's a new pair of shoes. So, Right, we'll move a few things to one side, guys. Oh, not gonna. That beautiful toilet, fellas, that is score of the day. How much is a toilet like that worth, fellas? Probably about uh, three or four hundred bucks, maybe more. Brand new toilet. Have a price check on the internet for me, guys, see what it's worth. Oh, stainless steel pots. G'day, mate. G'day. How are you? Okay. Pretty good. Oh. Might have been a stand for my worm farm. Golf clubs, guys, are those beautiful golf clubs? What brand are they, guys? They're really good golf clubs, too. Beautiful golf clubs, fellas. You all want them? They're common as dog poop golf clubs. I'll put them there and think about it. Hear me through this wind, guys. Risky. 
like that. Nothing wrong with it, guys. Beautiful esky brand new. Anyone need a foot spa massage thing? Get a free happy ending, guys, if you want that. You fellas don't know what a happy ending is. You Australian guys would, if you've ever been to Thailand. Tire ring for you fellas. I've got a pretty good sense of humour, guys. I don't really show it much, but my biggest problem, guys, is I've got a crappy smile. So I don't really smile, I smile too much. I don't want that tie, but we'll have a look at it in a minute. But I've got a pretty good sense of humour, fellas. Very dry and sarcastic. An old fire brush or something. What did I say guys? Free pumpkin. Free pumpkin, two bucks. Just saved myself two dollars, even though I've got them growing anyway. Pumpkin soup for dinner tonight, fellas. Or as we say, pumpkin soup for tea. Potatoes is what I need, guys. And what's this? All potatoes, what a sprout here. Full of maggots. Full of maggots, guys, but oh, here. Exactly what I need, guys. Free potatoes. Look at that beautiful. Beautiful smelly potatoes. Much more from anyway. Free veggies up here. So bear with me. So it's just been bulldozed recently too. Another toilet there. Probably brand new too. So probably would have been brand new that toilet. See just the waste fellas. All the waste beautiful wooden pallets. Like in America they get um, the scrap and pallet man. He gets two dollars per pallet that he hands in. And you know there's nothing like that what happens here in Australia. So sticking out the soil I'll pick that up later so yeah no it's shameful fellas all the waste beautiful plastic pellets over there look at that nothing wrong with them fellas all right what else is going to be here jeans never say no to a nice pair of jeans fellas probably what size target 92, I'm 97R. I've got so many clothes at the moment, guys, I don't really need them. But sh yeah, it's just a waste. Beautiful hats. Always come across good hats, guys. There's a lot of brand new hats, too, because they give away, obviously, brand new hats. And shops and stuff to promote their businesses like farm businesses there's a nice one there Celtics I don't want it right, fellas, what else can we say well I might end the video now guys because got to load all this stuff in the back of my truck um, but if I find anything exciting down the garden waste section I'll put the video on and I'll go for a better look in this but before I go beautiful old speakers fellas look at that channel 4 surround fellas look at the beautiful old 19 probably 60s era speakers See, something like that I wouldn't pick up guys I've just got no room for it it's just such a shame I know these would be worth a fair bit of money too Some beautiful speakers there guys
right, they're going to get buried, destroyed, fellas. Got no room for them. All right. Time to start loading my truck, guys, and we'll... No. And we'll keep going, and I'll come back later on the day if I find anything exciting. Um, I'll do another video. Another speaker box here, guys. There you are. Mattresses. Nothing underneath that mattress. Another tire rim here, guys. What a waste. Nothing even, you know, full of air still. Actually, look at this, guys. I don't think might be a spare tire for my trailer. I don't think it's got four wheel nut studs there. Probably would fit actually, but my trailer would be a lot lower. Let's have a look. See, four, four. Small tires. All right, guys. I'll think about this. But they are beautiful trailer wheels. Nothing wrong with them. Full of air. So, anyway, guys, appreciate you watching. Thanks for sticking with me. And we'll go down the garden waste section soon. Come back here later on in the day. About three, three or four hours time. So I've done pretty well so far, as you saw. Beautiful brand new toilet, scrap, and whatever else you saw. Thanks, guys. And we'll load up my truck before my dogs get saturated with blowflies. Because out these rubbish dumps, guys, during summer, the interior of my truck will be just covered in thousands of flies after, you know. 10 minutes sometimes straight away but it's a bit windy today guys so there's not many flies around all right thanks for watching everyone have a nice day wherever you are in the world and we'll chat soon appreciate you watching guys and thanks for all your beautiful comments and likes really appreciate it all my new subscribers and all 